In this video, we are going to look at how you can get VLC to automatically play subtitles to the videos that you're watching. Hi, my name is David from FreelancerInsights.com where we believe you should never stop learning. I have my video and subtitle file inside the same folder. And if I play my video with... Now, by default, the file will not show subtitles and if I right click on the video inside VLC you will see that the subtitle track is disabled and for me to watch the video with the subtitle file I'll need to click add subtitle file and navigate to the folder with the subtitle if I click on it and click on open and you can also see the other formats that are supported by uh, VLC uh, and it's a lot of formats including SRT.ASS and all that and click on open the subtitle track will be added and if I click on play or the spacebar the recent update on the YouTube interface it's now easier than before to download YouTube transcripts now basically the video is playing and if I right click inside VLC and check out the subtitle the subtitle track is active and uh, it, you can either disable or select track one uh, just this is for just uh, the purposes of this video we can just disable it and it will disappear and we can just uh, uh, select track one and it will uh, reappear when you play hi my name is that's how it's going to be but what we want for this video is to just get the video and the subtitle to play automatically without you needing to add the subtitle file to the video what you need are two things number one you need a folder this is my folder how to get VLC to automatically play subtitles and both my files are inside the same folder so what you need to do next is just select or decide on the name that you want both files to appear in so you just uh, let's say we take the video name to be the name for both the video but the extensions are different so this is a .mp4 uh, and for this one is a .srt which is SRT subtitles and if I click on it I just rename the file so that the names are identical but the extensions are different for the different uh, for the different files and when you do that if you just double click on the video file and I'll pause it if I play it with the recent app you'll see that it goes straight on to play the video with the subtitle file I don't need to right click and select subtitle and add the subtitle file and if you check the subtitle track the file is already added to the video and that's just by having the video our video and the subtitle in the same folder and ensuring that they have similar names so the video or VLC will automatically grab the subtitle data from the same folder and automatically play the video it on the YouTube interface with the subtitles so basically that's how you do it and an alternative way is that you can embed the subtitle file using handbrake uh, so that you can turn it on or off uh, and uh, you, another alternative is that you can permanently hard code or ban the subtitle inside the video. I have video tutorials on that and you can check them out from the cards above. So if you want to learn more about that. If you're interested in learning how to caption and subtitle videos to make money, you can check out my captioning course from the link below. Thank you so much for watching this video. And I hope that you've learned how easy it is to get VLC to automatically play subtitles for your videos. Until next time, never stop learning. Bye bye.